Congratulations on making the decision to go solar and taking control of your energy costs. The question you are now faced with is, should I lease or purchase my solar system? Every potential solar convert will have differing goals as to what they want to achieve by converting to solar. Here, we are going to deal with the most popular of those goals, saving money. The common solar lease may seem more attractive to many as the payments and structured and the system is maintenance free. But before opting for a lease, you need to look more closely. Payments can be set anything from a static charge for the term of the lease to a payment that escalates between 1 and 3% per year. Be careful, escalating payments can result in the total cost of your system being up to three times the purchase price. With a lease system, you are not, I repeat, not entitled to any federal or state tax credits. The leasing company own the equipment, therefore they will claim the incentives for themselves. With a lease, you never actually own the system. Because of this, you have no maintenance or insurance liability whatsoever. Before you get too excited, there are disadvantages to not owning the system on your roof. Before entering a lease, read the agreement very carefully as leasing companies commonly burden any property tax liability on the homeowner. In Arizona, homeowners with lease systems are for the first time receiving property tax bills that include an average $152 added for their leased solar system. Purchase systems in Arizona currently have no property tax liability at all. Leasing companies will require a 700 plus credit rating to approve lease financing. Purchasing your solar system is always the preferred method, that is, if you have a federal and state tax liability of over 30% of the system cost. The federal tax credit can be taken over a three-year period. States vary, so check first. Purchasing a solar system, unlike a lease, will leave you responsible for the maintenance and insurance. This should not be a major concern, as manufacturers' warranties are commonly 25 years for the solar panels and 10 to 20 years for the inverter. Insurance for the complete system should be added to your home insurance. This will cost upwards of $30 a year depending on your individual insurance company. Payments with a solar system purchase will depend on your individual finance plan but will normally be at a fixed repayment without any early settlement penalties. Interest rates vary but a 4.75% loan is achievable with a 700 plus credit score. Please be aware that you will be financing the entire cost of the system prior to receiving any federal and state tax credits. If you continue to pay the same amount as your electricity bill was prior to going solar and pay your tax credits off the principal, you should expect a payoff period of around the 10 year mark, which means for the next 15 years your electricity is in effect totally free. In conclusion, the decision is really quite simple. If you pay federal and state taxes, purchase. If you have no tax liability, lease. Call Natural Energy on 520-333-8284 and claim your totally free energy efficiency survey.